Hey guys, this is Mike, and uh, this is not going to be a tutorial video. Um, I just got a new Android phone, and uh, of course, the first thing I did was <laughs> to put the uh, Block Bunny game onto it. So, what I did was I created the Android projects for Block Bunny using uh, LibGDX, of course. I've already set it up and installed it onto here, my Galaxy S4. Awesome stuff. This is like factory right now. I, I don't have anything on it. It's not even activated. Uh, I just wanted to put the game onto it. Um, anyway, here it is. So the controls are the same as the mouse on the desktop game. Click the right side of the screen, or tap, I should say. Tap the right side of the screen to jump, left side to change colors. And uh, I just want to show you that it's working here. So green, red. This is actually really exciting for me because this is the first time I've ever put a game on any kind of mobile device. Um, so, this is really awesome. So, there it is. So, it's working fine. And, uh, yeah, I'm probably going to make a uh, tutorial on how to actually set up an Android project for LibGDX and then. Uh, put that Android project onto your phone. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you in the next Android tutorial.